We're building a solar furnace here for less than fifty dollars. Uh, we picked up this big piece of uh, black plastic for five dollars. It measures about three feet by five feet. And these window panes uh, we picked up at Bring Recycling too. They were two dollars each. They have an aluminum frame around the very thin glass, which makes it easy to mount. So what we're going to do here, we got the lumber cut. We're going to use just a regular. Uh, half inch lag bolt on the top and the bottom and uh, make make sure our glass fits. Now that we have our frame built, uh, just kind of roughed out, just put some lag bolts to hold it together. We're going to go ahead and set our glass and just to make sure everything's lined up good before we do our final lag bolt. And we want lots of frame around the glass. Doesn't have to be perfect. That's per that's gonna work fine for what we're doing. Now that I have the back black plastic on the back, and the structure is set up about the same height as the window, I have some ABS plastic that I have cut. This this piece, this angle, uh, screws right onto the top of the unit. And the piece I cut will be about mid-length into the window. Now I have the actual unit up high enough so it's really close and level to the window that I'm going to be using. And I have the pipe pl plugged in and it's ready to go. I'll just put the guts in here and then windows on the outside. Taking my dryer hose and using fishing line and, and staples very carefully kind of hanging it up. Now that I have my dryer vent tubing uh, fully installed and I'm pretty happy with it, it pretty much fills up the whole space. So what I'm going to do is put a, a real light coat of black spray paint on the aluminum and then I'm going to secure the, the windows after washing them really well. The final product, there's the intake uh, draws air out of the house and the, the exhaust it blows the warm air back into the house. The outside view, the intake, the white lines going down to the bottom of the solar furnace and then here's the, the exhaust going into the house with some just a simple 2x6 with holes drilled in it and some insulation wrapped around the pipe. And in the winter time, even here in Western Oregon, uh, there'll be enough solar radiation hitting this box to warm things up to circulate the air in the house a little bit and get it a little warmer.